Hey guys, this is Nick from ReviewOutlaw.com. Today I'm going to show you how to purchase an ant miner on Bitmain.com. So it's a little tricky to purchase um, an ant miner directly from the manufacturer because A, it's coming from China. And B, you're going to convert. Uh, normally, if you purchase something online, you're probably used to paying with a credit card. In this case, you need to pay with Bitcoin Cash, uh, as right now the only thing they're accepting before they're also accepting Bitcoin and Litecoin. So first, let's just take a look at what they have available. So you go to the Bitmain site, make sure it's secure and it's the main site. There is some, a lot of kind of scams out there that look like Bitmain sites. So if you Google it, make sure you're actually going to their site. So right now, you can see what we have for sale is an ant miner. We can look at the shipping dates. This is not actually going to be shipped out right away, so that's something you need to be aware of. Uh, depending when you're ordering it, it might be a couple months out. So I'm looking at the Ant Miner. Um, I, before I, I ordered this, I looked at the profitability on that and just quickly pull that up for you. Um, so if you go to Crypto Compare, the payback period, you can kind of see the payback, the cost, and what it's looking for right now being paid back. The S9 is actually rated pretty high as well right now, and I probably will purchase an S mine in the next week or two. But uh, time frame, the ant miner is coming first. So you're gonna just basically add that to the cart. Now this doesn't come, does not come with a power supply. So you're gonna need a power supply, and you know basically, I'd look for the December batch, whichever one's gonna be coming quicker. Um, and actually, I put the wrong one in my cart. So I'm going to add the right one. So just basically add that to the cart. And so you need one power supply and one ant miner. Um, I, I just personally like to get one at a time. You could get you know multiple, but if something happens to this company where they decide uh, we're just not going to fulfill the order, then you could be in some trouble. So I just like just to do one, get one in, and then order another one. Now here's here's the kind of tricky part. You're going to need something called Bitcoin Cash because right now that's all they're accepting. And you can see what they're accepting if you go to the products and you go down to let's say learn more and under payment. So right now it says only accepting Bitcoin Cash. Now this is um, not the easiest coin to get, altcoin to get. Um, First, you're probably gonna have to get something like Bitcoin. So the easiest way to do that is actually you could just go to like Coinbase. And here you can purchase it a couple different ways. Um, you could purchase it with your credit card or you can transfer it from your bank account. Now, a couple things about Coinbase for safety. Make sure you enable second factor authentication. So it's texting your, your cell phone a number or use something like Google Authenticator. The second thing I, I recommend you do is get your coins off of Coinbase because uh, let's say the whole Coinbase gets hacked, for example. Even though they have insurance, um, there's a lot of hacking attempts and things like that. It could take a while to get your coins back. So I recommend something called the Exodus Wallet. Basically, then you have control of your own coins or you could go with the Ledger Nano S. So Ledger, Ledger Nano S. This is a hardware wallet. Either one is, is gonna be safe, it's gonna be good. You can get these guys at eBay. Uh, or directly from the manufacturer themselves. Um, but between the two, and what I personally do is put like 50% of my Exodus wallet and 50% of my Ledger. Here's what I like about um, Exodus wallet though, is you can convert coins. So we can convert Bitcoin to Bitcoin Cash relatively easy um, and basically send it from, you know, uh, so let's say you basically step one, I'm kind of skipping steps, is buy some uh, Bitcoin which is going to take a couple days to get in and, and clear. That's going to be sitting in your Coinbase wallet. Then transfer it to Exodus. It's still going to be in Bitcoin. And then you need to convert it from Bitcoin to Bitcoin Cash. Um, and that takes about 30 minutes to transfer that. Now that you have the coins in Bitcoin Cash, you can finally do what you want to do in the first place and just purchase um, the ant miner. So let's go through here. Uh, we can check these guys off. We're going to click next. We're going to accept the terms. So you're going to want to verify your um, shipping address above um, and verify what's in the, what you're actually getting shipped. Choose the carrier. Look at the shipping cost. Um, and then we can submit. You know, this is kind of hard to read. Please input the answer. 
All right. So now we have 30 minutes to actually submit the money from from uh, the account. So we're going to basically, I have uh, Exodus open right here. And you need to go in here and I have the, the funds already in here. And I'm going to click send. And then I'm going to basically I'm gonna continue the order. Oh, so actually looking after shipping now, I'm going to need about $1,800. So I'm going to need to exchange. So the way that this exchange works is um, you basically hit the exchange button and then you can exchange. So I've started the exchange, basically exchanging some Litecoin for some Bitcoin cash. And here I can view um, on their website just to see the progress of that. Um, and it, it takes about 15 to 30 minutes for it to exchange. So. Um, once that clears, it just ends up in my wallet. Okay, so I finished uh, the transaction and um, converted my Litecoin to um, Bitcoin Cash. So basically, I want to verify that I have enough um, Bitcoin in my account, which is uh, Bitcoin Cash, sorry, 1.38, and then we hit submit. So basically I have about an hour for this uh, payment to clear. You just want to verify all the information is correct and then uh, go ahead and you're going to basically send this amount of Bitcoin to this payment address in a Bitcoin cash. Sorry. Now you definitely don't want to mess that up. Um, you do not want to send Bitcoin to a Bitcoin cash account. That will definitely be very difficult to, to get back and almost impossible. So make sure you're using Bitcoin cash when you're sending this. So here we have the amount. You're going to verify the payment address, QR code. Usually just check the last four digits and the first four digits. Um, there are viruses out there that will actually change this number on you without you paying attention. So if you're copying and pasting any Bitcoin address, verify those numbers. Um, <clears throat> and then as far as the amount here, you're going to make sure that this is exactly to the number correct. Um, and if there's any fees or anything like that, that it's just it's accurate and you're paying that on top of this amount which uh, if you're using the Exodus wallet should be fine okay after double checking it just one more time two or three times because uh, once you send this it is gone so we've double checked the amounts the totals the numbers and we're gonna hit send it's gonna ask you one more time to verify the amount 18 right number there again verifying last couple verifying the last couple digits there and we hit send cool so transaction is complete so after a little while on the bit uh, bitmain site you're going to be able to go in here and you're actually going to be able to view the order and see that the payment was received and then it's going to give you an email once your item has shipped so that's um, how to order directly from bitmain obviously a lot of steps um, it, it's the least amount of money you're going to pay for um, an ant miner compared to eBay or Amazon but um, definitely a lot of hoops you have to jump, jump through and you're waiting quite a long time so it, it's up to you whether that's worth it I think for your first ant miner it probably be worth spending extra money getting it on eBay um, you know getting one from the United States in stock seeing how that works and then after that if you like it more you could buy your future um, ant miners direct from Bitmain all right, guys, hope you liked the video. If you have any questions, feel free to let me know in the bottom. And if you liked the video, also give me a thumbs up. Thanks. Hey, guys. Thanks for watching my video. If you have time, please subscribe to my channel. Click here to watch more videos. Or please give me a thumbs up. Thanks.